Well, here we are back with Sean Jones. What an amazing story, Sean, of we don't know yet whether it was an angel, a messenger from God, but somebody came and intervened at just the right time and you turned to the Lord and you went from a person who had never shared their uh, faith, never shared their testimony, right, with anyone. Right. And, and now you're serving in full-time ministry with E3 Canada as the strategy coordinator for I Am Second Canada. Now, first, before you tell me how that happened, tell our viewers what I Am Second is, because some of them will probably recognize it by some of the videos, but tell us what it is. Yes. so. We're a faith-based multimedia movement, viral movement. We create these short stories on film, um, famously known, you know, in a white chair. And it's usually a story of um, somebody who went through a very difficult thing in their life and, uh, you know, they met God or they found God. And in that process, God changed their lives. And, uh, yeah. and so my story is a little similar to that. And I have a passion because of that. And, and I just love to be able to represent uh, I Am Second in Canada and to further the reach to, to my fellow Canadians. Well, how did that happen? I mean, you left us kind of hanging there. You're in South <laughs> Africa, and you said that somehow it got resolved. So what, you ended up in Canada? So really through a prophetic word, uh, a friend of mine in South Africa shared that God had given him a dream that I'd be actually moving to Canada and that I would be pursuing uh, ministry in a church moving, a, a, minister, a church planting ministry uh, that would use testimonies to touch and speak to thousands of people. And, you know, if I'm totally honest, at that time when I received that, that, that message, I thought, this is crazy. You know, I'm a guy that sits in the back row in church and uh, tries to not get noticed. And uh, I think God really was after my heart completely still, even in those early days. And, uh, you know, I'd asked him to show me my, my calling, and he did. And uh, I caution anyone who's not ready to receive that, careful what you ask for, because God, <laughs> if you nag him long enough, he'll answer you, and uh, you might not be ready for the message. Well, I think that is a very good word that, you know, we can think that it's all about us and how we serve God, but he uses the, the most unlikely to do the most amazing things. And he wants to use everybody, right? That's the story of I Am Second. I 100% agree, Laurie. I really do. Yeah, and uh, and so uh, through a process, um, which is very quick, to be honest, um, you know, God landed me back here in Canada. Um, I, I came through an international transfer with the company I was working with at the time. And, uh, um, you know, we pursued uh, different churches, got connected with people. And I think I found myself running from this calling. I just wasn't interested. Uh, you know, I thought this was a mistake. God surely had something else for me. But, you know, he was hunting me down, and uh, I just would meet person after person involved in church plotting movements, and uh, I would run from them until the moment that I actually uh, moved to a new area, a new neighborhood um, in Kitchener, Ontario, and started attending a new church. And a very good friend that I made at this church, um, you know, we started walking with one another and, uh, you know, hanging out, and uh, he could see I was troubled by something, and uh, he, he invited me to lunch, and I shared my heart, and I said to him, yeah, man. I'm really burdened, you know, God's given me this calling apparently and I just don't believe it. And then this friend of mine happened to be the director for E3 Canada and he just chuckled and laughed and he said, Sean, um, I'm actually the E3 director for E3 Ministries in Canada and, uh, you know, we're a church planting movement and, and you know, and I just, <laughs> at that moment, I just completely released and gave it to God and said, look, if you're going to pursue me, even with my good friends, um, I better listen and 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 uh, I better put my my put my plan down and and yeah. pick up yours. So good, you know. You can run, but you cannot hide from the love <laughs> of God and the will of God for your life. Like He came and found you. Well, I am second. Essentially means Jesus is first. I am second, right? That's yes, the I message. Yes, and I go a step further because um, I actually like looking at it in this perspective. Living second is not meaning um, I'm second to God. It really means I'm living second in every situation in life, which means I'm living from a place of second. I put my wife first. I put my family first. I put my friends first. I even put my enemies first. And, uh, you know, this is a concept that can really change the world if, if people embrace it and realize, hey, hang on a second. 
the first person to live second was probably Jesus. And mm -hmm. the example, the, per the first perfect example was, was Jesus when he came and showed us, you know, just what it meant to live second. And yeah. uh, that's what inspires me just to, just to do what I'm doing, Laurie. Well, I love it. We're both in the testimony business, right? We're testimony ministry, I should yes. say, sharing stories across Canada. So we are here, like you, partnering with you. Tell us quickly, what is I Am Second currently doing in Canada and how can the viewers get involved? Yes, thank you so much. So firstly, I would really love for the Canadian viewers to hop onto our website and go through the experience. It's www. I'm second.com. And I say the experience because it's much more than just uh, a website where you can go and watch videos. Uh, we have so many incredible tools available on the website. So you can go in, watch one of the white chair films. If you're touched and moved by this, uh, we have an opportunity for you to actually register your email address with us, uh, share some information and get connected with a live second coach, uh, or if you prefer to actually get in contact with somebody who would put you into a Live Second group. These groups are spreading all across North America, and it's just a fantastic community to be a part of. Um, there's so many teaching tools uh, on the website as well, which are there to help people uh, share God's story, but also to help you share your own story. And so that's something that I'd really love the viewers to do. Um, we also, you know, we're connecting with churches uh, uh, countrywide. We love to share some of the stuff that I'm Seconds doing in Canada, um, as well as we've got a team on the streets, you know, on the ground, on a ground level that go out and share the love of Christ. You know, that's some way that uh, the viewers can get connected. We also just want to quickly um, give a promo to a shout out to the I Am Second Canada social media handles. You know, the social media handles are growing um, all the time. Uh, we love Canadians to go out and check out I Am Second Canada on, on Facebook and on Instagram. And, and this is also a way that they can reach out directly to me um, if, if you'd like to get more connected with I Am Second in Canada and, uh, you know, and see what we're doing. Well, praise God for what you're doing. Uh, together, let's continue to tell the story of God across our nation. Thank you, Sean, so much for being with us. Amen. Thank you so much, Lori. God bless. Well, go to 700club.ca to find out more about I Am Second Canada and Sean.